and show you a method on how to transfer photos from an Android device to an iPhone and vice versa super super easily it doesn't require you to plug them to a computer or anything like that it's completely wireless now it could take a couple of seconds you know it really just depends up to a couple minutes maybe depending on how many photos you're trying to send but if it's a you know one photo or like even like a couple hundred photos it really shouldn't take too long and I've talked about this method you know a couple weeks ago on this channel too but I'll go ahead and show you exactly how to do it. You don't have to download any apps or anything. So in order to do it, the first thing you want to do is you want to go to this website, which is snapdrop.net, and you want to go on it on both devices. And as you can see, as long as you have them on both you know, phones, like I have it on here and I have it on here, you should be able to see one another on this specific web page, which is really good. As long as you see those two devices, then you're set. Now, you want to go on the device where you want to send the data from. So if, let's say I have photos on my Android I want to send over to my iPhone, all I have to do is go ahead and go on my page you want to tap on that specific phone, a little pop-up will come up, and all you have to do is pick, you know, the gallery or wherever you want to go. Now, in this case, let's say I want to send all three, and let's just pick a couple photos here and there. So let's just say I want to send these photos to my specific iPhone, right? Once I select them, I'm going to go ahead and click Done, which is up here. It's going to probably take a second. You'll see how far it's gone, you know, in a second or two. It's going to take you know, a couple of seconds, I'm sure. As you can see, it's saying transferring. Now, I want you to look at my iPhone. I'll probably skip ahead a little bit so you guys don't have to wait for it. But essentially, it'll send over to my iPhone right here. And I'll be able to download them onto my iPhone, which is really, really cool. And it really shouldn't take too long, so I'll just fast forward and I'll tell you guys how long it took. Now, I did have to go and refresh the page. It took a second or two for it to go through. I just had to refresh it. But essentially, what happens then is you'll get a little pop-up on your iPhone that looks like that. And I'll go and swap devices and all you have to do here is go and click download and I'll go ahead and start downloading within Safari and you can do this for every single image that I was sent over so as you can see every single image I want to go ahead and download it yada 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 and it could take a second and those were some of the photos that I resent to myself just now when I had to refresh it now if you click the little tab up here you'll see all those images that I just sent and when I tell you it literally took like two seconds to do it's not even like it literally took seconds I didn't have to usually I had to go and upload them to Google Drive and send them back and then go on my Google Drive here and then upload them it was like such a mess I didn't like doing that and you could do the same thing over to this device too now, now as you can see I probably have to refresh the page here and refresh the page here and as you can see that works so you just have to refresh every once in a while now if I want to do the same thing let's see I just want to send this photo over to there I can go and tap on that image it'll go and transfer over there and as you can see it took a little bit longer than I thought but still you know much faster than if I were to go and you know text it over or whatever I'm sure and that's really pretty much the process snapdrop.net great website highly recommend it and that's really pretty much the process if you guys have any other questions or anything leave it down in the comment section below hit the like button on me so much but definitely hit that subscribe button every single subscriber that we get really does count so me so much if you guys can hit that also check out the other links down in the description as well my twitter my instagram my second channel all those links are linked down below i'd really appreciate it if you guys would check it out more importantly than everything else i love every single one of you guys hopefully i'll catch you guys in the next video peace out till then